feel like I haven't gotten to you in a little bit, Candace. So when you I gotta say, you've been pretty patient, and now you're finally in the starting line. Feel good, Candace. You know, I'm just glad coaching my But was it hard to stay quiet when you weren't getting as much playing time? Honestly, nah. Look, I'm not the type that causes thinking. the Pistons to start out and bring clearly a lot of games left on the schedule but when do players start taking notice of the standings? Yeah, I feel like all-star break is always the time Kevin where you're looking at things and you're trying to do the math about okay let's see we got 34 games to go we're gonna have to you know be 20 and 14 to get ourselves into this position uh, but usually at the all-star break when guys are away you take assessment of that and then you know that second half of run where you've got to get to in order to be a team competing in the postseason. MV with a screen on George. The 17-footer. And good. Got the English that time as it falls. Jackson just sharing the rock there with the teammate. Make the simple play. To the inside. Ibaka. And Ibaka slams it in. He does that so well. At his size, he's always a threat to throw it down. MP with a screen on George. Jackson passes to MP. And Olenek kicks to MP. No good from outside. And I thought that was going to drive. It looked good from here. It's been interesting to watch the evolution of Serge Ibaka just improving that shooting and that confidence to be a perimeter threat. And on our sideline, our reporter, David Aldridge. Dwayne Casey gave me a few minutes to catch up with him. He and his assistants are trying to figure out ways to run Paul George off of the three-point line. Coach said even though George is a good passer, he's an elite shooter. He'd rather force him into making plays for others. This is the kind of problem that a superstar presents every night. Kevin? All right, David, thanks. Now here's Jackson. After the miss from Reggie Jackson. And with Ibaka, he doesn't shoot a lot anymore, but he's still very efficient. Well, I think, Kevin, that's what makes him an ideal player. Oh, wow. That's what. Defensive foul. Number 14. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for... We're just about two minutes into the first quarter. Now Cunningham. Playing Milwaukee, he was nearly unstoppable. MV finds a limit. Now here's Cunningham, guarded by Jackson. They get it back. Here's MP. And he uses the glass on the lane. MP's got six. And you know what? He doesn't mind getting his hands dirty when it comes to really fighting on the backboard. Not only fighting on the boards, he's converting, and not just on the putback. And a great start for him. And the rejection by MP. Down low. And that'll be two free throws. Serge Ibaka. Serge Ibaka picks one up there. Yeah, easy call. The Pistons shooting their first free throws of the game. For the Clippers, Zubac is checked in for Ibaka. Batum comes in for Mann. And Eric Bledsoe subbed in for Reggie Jackson. Then for the Pistons, Stewart's checked in for Olenek. Grant comes in for Sadiq Bey. And Diallo subbed in for Jackson. Cunningham dishes it to MP. MP sets the screen for Cunningham. Bloodso outside. Pass to George. Now here's Zubac. Zubac's a screen on Stewart. No good from Zubac. He creates such a great opportunity right at the rim, and he just can't get it to go, even with the defense not really a factor. Diallo finds Stewart. To the paint. Shot clock at six. 
Batum against Grant. And the rejection by Zubox. And there's the shot clock. Fast defense. Stolen by George. On the floor for Detroit, they've got MP. Sadiq Bey is out there with the limit. Then it's Josh Jackson, and it's Cunningham into the one spot. All right, well, look at how the hustle game has been going for the Clippers. And it's been about their defense. They're playing with a frenetic pace, putting a lot of pressure on the ball handlers and forcing turnovers. And maybe a signal as well of how aggressive their defense has been tonight is to look at how many points they have directly off of a turnover. Good activity there. Here's MP. He's off on that one. So the Clippers will take it the other way. They come into this one following the loss to the Mavericks. Yeah, a snowball effect in that one. One thing would go wrong, but then another, then another. Really, the story of the game. Yeah, it felt like just the entire roster was stuck in neutral. There was nobody offensively that could get anything going. Clock is at three. Snatched up. And the rejection by MP. And it's out of bounds. Jackson. And Detroit has possession. Eight-point game. They put up a nice win against the Bucks the last time out. Yeah, and with most of the arena against them, they just banded together and trusted one another to make the right play. Yeah, and in that game, it turned into a massive <laughs> scoring night. It wasn't so much about the, the game plan as it was establishing early confidence to get that win. And you can see why Cunningham elicits comparisons to Luka Doncic can control the pace of the game, very high basketball IQ, and shows a maturity beyond his years. Screen by Ibaka. A shot, no good. Good defense by MP. Pistons trail by six. Here in the second quarter, we've played a little over two and a half minutes now. Jackson kicks to Cunningham. Here's MP, and the rejection by Ibaka. Well, this will always be a part of Serge's game. Rim protection on the inside. That's nasty. Bobs it up for Ibaka, and Ibaka slams it in. Great to get Ibaka involved at the rim, build his confidence. He's such a big target down there. And also like Doncic, Cunningham can put the offense on his back and carry. He could put up 50-plus numerous times in his career because he has deep range, can break down defenders off the dribble, and if you run two at him, he will immediately find the open man. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Paul George has taken some heat in recent years. He says people get so caught up in what other folks think. I'm Paul George. I don't care to be anybody else. I am who I am. You love it or you don't. Simple as that. Guys, with his player on the floor, he has answered all of his critics. He is certainly playing at an elite the rim so far in this one single-handedly providing great rim protection been aggressive to block shots but also avoiding fouls that's a that's a heavy presence inside our second half of basketball and presented by Gatorade let's see who's all fueled up and on the floor to start the third taking a look at Los Angeles 
Serge Ibaka. At the five. The guard spot filled by Jackson and George. And it's man and at the small forward position. And a lot of players want a voice in team strategy. And I've always wondered, Greg, is there a downside for coaches letting their players get too involved? I mean, there is a belief that you can have too many cooks in the kitchen, right? But if a player knows his stuff, it's worth at least hearing them out, if only to keep those open lines of communication. And this is right around the time when one team might start to pull away. Yeah, this team is looking to add to the lead, trying to put the other team away, and threatening here. And it's blocked by Ibaka. Here's Mann. He's defended by Bay. Goes back up. Outside for George. Money from the win. And it's a 12-point Clipper lead. He's doing a lot of nice work now from the field. He's helped get them this lead, and now he's helped them keep it. Now, here's Cunningham. He's guarded closely. Here's MP. And that one is good with the extra effort on the glass. MP's got four points this quarter. You don't want to ever give up points on the boards. That's the lesson for the team there. That's a hustle play to save points. Baca against MP. Six on the shot clock. Back to Ibaka. To the wing right side. And the rejection by MP. And it's out of bounds to the Clippers as the Clippers retain possession. Here's George, 11 points in the game. He missed that one, but I've seen him drill shots from that distance in warm-ups. Oh, no, I know he can make it, but th that's warm-ups, so maybe just a step too far. And two shots coming up at the... Shooting for Detroit. Number and the 13. foul called on Los Angeles. Shooting the Pistons shoot their seventh and eighth attempts at the foul line tonight, and he makes the first. And both free throws good for MP. Clippers leading by eight. Outside, George. Ibaka with a screen on Jackson. To the middle. And it's blocked. What a play as he just snatches the shot out of midair. Now, here's Cunningham, guarded by Jackson, with the shot. Here's MP, and the layup fall. MP's got eight here in the quarter. They didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time. Jackson deciding where to go with it. Here's Mann. He's defended Two by Bay. Six to shoot. Jackson from long range. Bay pulls it in. Pistons trail by six. Pass to Olenek. Pass to MP. Good on the short little jump shot. 17 points for MP. I'll tell you, they're right in this. We'll see if they can maintain Clippers momentum. Yeah, this is not the team that... Final quarter of play here, three minutes in. Two minutes. George against Jackson, outside for Bledsoe. A shot's good on the assist by George. Well, you we have to honor it from there as Eric Bledsoe fully capable of knocking it down. On the court for the Pistons, Sadiq Bey is out there with a lift. And it's Cunningham, then it's MP, and it's Jackson, and at the two spot. 
and a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot. Important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for the Pistons. We've seen them make the extra effort from a defensive standpoint, closing out airspace and sending shots back. Now the team has also done a really good job of grinding it out on the offensive glass. Those second chance points have added up for them over the course of the game. Catching up on the changes for Los Angeles. Serge Ibaka, he's checked in for Zubats. Marcus Morris comes in for Isaiah Hartenstein. Mann's checked in for Nicholas Batum. And Reggie Jackson subbed in for Eric Bledsoe. Bay finds MP. Detroit needs to get off a shot. Shot clock at two. And again, it's the Pistons missing. Clippers trail by three. The pass to George. 55 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Screened by Ibaka. It's in! And oh, that was an enormous three-pointer. He's a guy that lives for a big moment like that. Great focus and courage in the clutch. MP sets the screen for Olenek. Back to MP. Count. Remember that one. Guys, a difference. Oh, man. It's up with our sideline reporter David Oden. Hey Kevin, during that last break of Hurts, Ron Lewis is talking to the team. This game's still up for grabs. He told his team, hey, we're in position to take this one, guys. Let's stay focused and stay together and we'll get it done. See how it plays out, Kevin. Sure. Rebound by the Pistons. And now we've got it. Paul Gordon. his first personal foul. Second team foul. To the three point lead. Josh Jackson athletically is one of the Clippers more intriguing five. players in the loudest and Get a free t shirt. Let's see it, fans. All right. Look who's coming on the court. Come on, get loud for your Clippers spirit. 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. George looking over the floor. There's Jackson with the three. No good. And now they foul. Marcus Morris Sr. That's his first personal foul. Third team. That's the first. That puts them up by five. Shooting for Detroit. Number 13. Second one is good. Getting both at the line. And it's a six-point ball game. Ooh, I think that's a wrap. And I can tell you, you can't have more pressure-packed free throws than the ones that are going to seal the game. And so it's Detroit with the W. A truly That's the end of the game. Thank you for coming out to support your team. Make sure to get home safely, and we'll see you at the next sporting event. Andrew, what's going on? Thanks, MP. The team seems to be really gelling lately. Is there anything you feel like you guys need to work on? Uh, on a court, no. Off, oh yeah. Are there some internal issues bubbling up? No, just some of the guys here don't look sharp enough. You know, we should have some standards. Ah, okay, I see. Anybody in particular need the most help? Well, I got a teammate or two who could use some assistance, and you've traveled with us a bit, so you all know the guys I'm talking about. What they do in their own time is fine, but coming into the arena on the team bus? <laughs> look, so... You gonna throw him a bone and help out? Hey, look, I probably have to. And I might got to do a trip down. All right, let's go with Frank. I feel like it's been a minute since we talked. What's on your mind? Now, you were super aggressive on the board tonight, Em. Look, Coach does a great job setting expectations. Em nice to see everyone. No, I feel like I ain't caught on John a little bit. What's up, Jay? So what was it like to finally... You know, it was it was gratifying, John. You really don't seem like the type of person who complains, do you? You know, my parents, they didn't raise me to whine when things didn't go. Okay, we good? Thank you.
Yeah, MP saying all the right things in public. What did you expect? That's what he's supposed to say. But I'm hearing he wants out. That's right. He wants to be traded. The coach doesn't like him. He doesn't like the coach. So it's no surprise. Really. Plus, he's spoiled. He's used to getting whatever he wants just because people know his face. But it doesn't work like that in the NBA. You got to earn your respect here. If MP thinks a change of scenery is going to solve all his problems, he got another thing coming to him. He's got to learn to respect the game, the basketball guards or what they call them. There's no shortcuts in this league. Doesn't matter how famous you are off the court. Hey, look, man, we need to talk about this Kendrick Perkins report. What about it? Look, Perk is a big personality, but he's not a straight up liar. So, look, I need to know if there's any truth to this. Do you want out? I mean, I had some good moments this year, but this is where I want to be. Look, I started my career here. I want to finish it. 